sculptor Umberto Boccioni was their first sort of impression, their first inspiration. And I was like, well, that's really exciting. I'm just going to use a can here as a big roller. Um, and I was really excited about you know, the idea of a big graphic shape, but I wanted to soften it, to modernise it. Um, and we talked about the films of Douglas Sirk, uh, you know, the ones with Rock Hudson, Lauren Bacall. What's the film called? That, um, with the actual film. Um, oh, okay. Give me one second, I do have an actual film for you. Uh, refer to notes when in doubt. <laughs> Here we go. Yep, I am. All that heaven allows and written on the wind. There we go. Movies. They're all like real technicolor with Rock Hudson when he was, you know, very straight, not. Um, so they were kind of super fabulous at that time. So all the models will have this hair today? Yeah, everybody's having it. And, it, you know, it's all about old school glamour. It really is, you know, it's Elizabeth Taylor, who killed Virginia Woolf. I want some real updos. I want to look tumbly and crazy and sexy. I don't want looking like the hair's been thrown up. But obviously, you know, we've put a lot of preparation into it. We've used the Moroccan oil styling cream and frizz control spray as a foundation with a lot of the spray at the roots and then dried it into the hair. And then we, as we've set the front area, we've separated the front and the back area. So we've got this sort of French pleat at the back here, which in this one. Yeah, I, want to, I want to see that French pleat a little bit, so... Thanks, babe. There you go. You know, I wanted to sort of show it off a little bit, but then use it as a foundation. And then, you know, just let some bit through. We're, we're combing the hair out rather than brushing it out. So it leaves these kind of curls on the ends. You know, very Liz Taylor, no prime. I love when it a little bit falls down. See the front shape just turn it